हॅलो आय एम डॉक्टर मंजिरी वळसंकर डायरेक्टर भिडे हॉस्पिटल टेस्टिव बेबी सेंटर नवी पेठ पुणे टुडे लेट एस टॉक अबाउट द इम्पॉर्टन्स ऑफ कॅरिओटायपिंग टेस्ट इन आय व्ही एफ ना वॉट इज दिस कॅरिओटायपिंग वेन एव्हर अ लेडी कॅन नॉट कन्सीव्ह वी इव्हॅल्युएट हर अँड हर हजबंड्स सीमेन टू फाइंड आउट वेदर शी हॅज द कपॅसिटी टू गो अहेड अँड कॅन गेट गुड अमाऊंट ऑफ रिझल्ट्स इन आय व्ही एफ नाव वेन एव्हर वी आर डुईंग एनी काइंड ऑफ assisted reproduction may it be ivf or icc or blastocyst we are using the raw materials that is the eggs or the oocytes from the female and the sperms from the male or her husband now whenever we are going ahead we have to know whether these gametes that is the eggs and the sperms which we are trying to make into an embryo are chromosomally normal or not by which we mean that the dna testing of that particular individual should be perfectly fine to be able to make a completely normal embryo this dna testing can be done with various tissues like the hair or it can be done on various skin blood and various other tissues but the simplest is the blood test so a blood karyotyping which means the chromosomal arrangement of the man and his wife can be assessed with the help of a simple blood test the karyotyping test needs processing time of around 2 to 3 weeks time after which you get a chromosomal arrangement of the male and the female so the female is a 46xx male is a 46xy in certain males as well as females we have found that there are certain alterations or aberrations in these chromosomal parameters and these patients have to be referred to a geneticist before we decide to make an embryo out of their own gametes so if your ivf consultant has advised you karyotyping which is a dna testing do not worry at all it is just because we need to know whether your eggs and your husband's sperms are chromosomally normal or not and and then that is a green signal for us to go ahead for any kind of a ivf procedure thank you